Hi there, my name's Lachlan. I'm just doing a little screencast for you showing you how to back up your database in WordPress. Now, I've logged into a WordPress uh, installation that I have here, and it's told me that WordPress 2.9.2 is available, and that I can update. So, if I click on the update now, um, WordPress is very, very nice, and it, it tells me that I can upgrade automatically, which is the easy option, but it also warns me that um, I should update my, sorry, back up my database files before I update. Um, and I found this this out the hard way last year. Um, I took the lazy option and upgraded a WordPress site automatically um, without backing up. And unfortunately, somehow the database became corrupted. Um, so there's a very good reason for why WordPress tells you that you should back up your database. Uh, and there's no reason not to because it's very, very easy. And I'm going to show you how to do that right now. Um, what we're going to do is scroll down to the plugins area and click add new. And I'm going to do a search for backup. So this searches the WordPress plugin repository um, directly from within WordPress. And I get a list of, of plugins that match my search. Now the very first one is great. I've used this on lots of websites. Um, I'm sure many of the other options are great too, but I go for the WordPress database backup plugin by Austin Matsko. Um, and I'm just going to click install here on the right. And you can read through the description and so on. Um, I found this, this plugin to be to be just what I needed, so I'm going to click install now. And WordPress has installed that for me and asks me if I want to activate it. So activating that plugin. And now I should see WordPress database backup down here in my plugin list. Um, additionally, in my tools, I'll now have an extra option to back up. So that'll appear in your tools menu. Click on that, and you have a few options. Um, in the back end, you can choose to to back up um, your spam comments and so on. It excludes them by default because you know you wouldn't usually care too much if your spam comments um, didn't get included in the backup. It's just it's a bit of pointless data. So I'm going to scroll down and the uh, the option to download to your computer is quick and easy. And you can, if you want to, have the email back. Um, sorry, the backup email to you, or save it onto your server. But you don't want to leave the backup on your server for any period of time, um, because someone else could come along and snipe that directory on your web server and take your backup and have a complete backup of your site, and possibly even reverse engineer your passwords and so on. So you really don't want to leave backups floating around on your server. Um, so the, the quick and easy option is just to download to your computer. I'm going to go for that. I click Backup Now. And the next thing we get is a little uh, this blue Ajax uh, progress bar telling us how far um, through the backup process it is. You can see it's going pretty quickly. And it finishes and tells me it's done. And would I like to save this uh, SQL file, that's the database file, um, to my computer? And I do want to do that. So I'm going to click Yes. And the file's downloaded. So that's great. We've backed up the database. If anything goes wrong, I can use that to restore um, the, the site to how it was before. Uh, so having done that backup, I can now proceed to um, this update, WordPress update at the top. I'm going to click that. Um, and I can, I can upgrade automatically. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is going to be fine. But um, if anything goes wrong, I can re revert to that database backup. Now we're just waiting. There we go. Um, WordPress downloaded the update uh, from WordPress.org and unpacked it on the server, installed the latest version, upgraded the database, and it tells me that WordPress has been upgraded successfully. So I can flip over and have a look at the site now, and I should see that is working perfectly and it's running um, the latest version of WordPress. So I hope that helped. 
um, just to illustrate the simple process of backing up and don't do your backups without, sorry, don't do your um, updates without a backup. Okay, take care everyone, over and out.